So should I do the not thing in the front thing? You like it like this? Thank you. Are you flirting with me now? Thank you. Even more bonus points. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Arthur Basil. And I'm an art lecturer, an art educator, uh, and today an art interpreter. Very important because we're all going to interpret this beautiful work of art together. Make sure that you've got a good view of it. You've got to be able to see it to interpret it. We're going to be doing this together today, so pay close attention. This work of art is called Stop. And it's a very famous work of art from the circular period. And I know it's a very detailed work of art, but I'd ask you to reduce it to its truest form. You know, you've got straight lines and curvy lines and there's black and that there's white and such, but ignore all of that. Reduce it to its most simple form, to the true essence. You can literally reduce it in size quite a bit. And I think once you do that, you might be able to see that appearing more and more. The key to this is what you hold in your hand. The totality of the appearances of this work of art in that key can reveal the truth. And it will appear many times in its literal form that you see here before you, but maybe once it'll appear not in its literal form, but serving the same function as it does the rest of those appearances. Remember, the totality of all of those appearances can reveal the truth to your progress. That's all I've got.